Yeah, yeah so at Plan Blue, we're basically mapping underwater. For example, uh, what, what Google does above water, you know, in Google Maps, or what Apple does with, with Street View and stuff like that, we try to do something similar, but then underwater. Yeah, so we developed a technology that makes uh, seafloor monitoring much easier, much faster. And uh, we can support, for example, support the offshore wind industry to monitor those pillars that they, that they have to monitor every, every year, the underwater constructions, monitor plastic waste, uh, enhance biofuel production from seaweeds, uh, and of course help climate change because uh, we can make, with our technology, climate models much better for predicting the effect of climate change on seafloors. Because seafloors are really important because they're a very important source of food, for example, for us as, as people. So at the moment, we are uh, we just founded last year, so a very young company. We have now a total of 12 people uh, with us, uh, six full-time, two uh, part-time, and four students as well. And uh, yeah, we had the first customers, first projects that we did. We are, got the first investors on board, and now we're ready to expand the team. So that's why I'm here at Slush, to meet more potential investors, partners, and the new customers as well. Yeah, there is definitely underwater mapping before. But we use a different uh, technology. We don't use normal cameras. We use hyperspectral cameras. And hyperspectral cameras uh, are uh, much more, they have m much more data basically that you get than normal cameras. So where normal cameras are our eyes, they basically get three colors. So the red, green, and blue. Uh, hyperspectral cameras don't look at just three colors. They look at hundreds of colors. And based on those colors and how light is being reflected off an object, we think can very accurately say what, what is. So that means that once you have trained our technology to recognize objects on the water, specific ones, you don't need to have experts do that anymore. So basically anybody can monitor them and get really good quality data.